Hi, so today I'm going to look into Yolanda Brown. She is, I don't know her age, but she's missing out of Georgia. And she was last seen heading home from a, a pub. Um, some man was asked to follow her home. That's that's what it uh, was stated, that some man was supposed to follow her home. He lost track of her. But she has been missing for about a week, I think. So what I want to do, I just want to look and get a quick look into what could possibly be going on with her. I'm not doing the usual spread. So this is Yolanda Brown and she goes by Yo-Yo. So let's see. So here we have, this is some corruption. So something is not going right. Something is going on. Corruption, hidden agendas. This is someone in your group of friends or someone in your community, someone in your circle. And here is someone being submissive, going along with something. So we have some, some corruption going on between somebody that was in her circle, someone in her group of friends. Okay. Um, and somebody is, whoever this is, somebody is going along with whatever this corruption is here. So let's look into that. So let's go into this corruption. Okay, this is an ex. So whether that's an ex-friend, ex-boyfriend, ex-coworker, whatever it is. Okay, there's some corruption going on. There's some hidden agendas going on that's connected to an ex. This is someone who is unstable, rebellious. Okay, so this person could just be into whatever. They're doing some underhanded things here because it's connected to some corruption. But this is some type of ex, whether it's an ex-friend, ex-boyfriend, ex-whatever. Now, this is someone in your group of friends, someone in your circle, someone in your community. So this is some illegal activity or drug use. So either someone in her circle of friends, someone, so it has to be someone she is around. Is it to some illegal activity here with this corruption or this could be drug use? So drug use could just be drinking, smoking, whatever drug, whatever it is. But this is someone that you trusted. So someone in her circle that she had some type of trust for is doing some illegal activity or drugs. Okay, whatever that may be. And here you have someone being submissive. So somebody is going along with something here. Okay, somebody is going along with something, but see, they know what happened because see somebody, this is the truth being told to someone about some violence. So somebody is going along with it, but they're not doing anything about it. They know because someone told them about this violence. So somebody else is going along with this. It's not just one person. Somebody else knows what happened because we have somebody in her circle and then we have people going along with whatever this violence was because it was told to them whatever this violence was about or what happened. Here, someone in her group of friends, that's someone that she trusted or had trust for that she thought she could trust. Some illegal activities going on with that person. And here you have some, uh, like I said, hidden agendas going on here connected to an ex that's kind of off the off the wall here because this person is rebellious. They do they do whatever they want to do. Okay. So let's see how this connects. Okay, so here you have this is someone who is trying to plead or negotiate compromise with somebody. You're trying to make a deal with someone working stuff out. Okay. So 
You're trying to negotiate a plan or make a deal, whatever. This is someone trying to get away from a person or a situation. So let's look into that. Here you have here, this is someone who's hard-headed. They're going to do whatever they want to do, okay? They're not going to listen to something that you say, and we know this because this person is impulsive here. So they're going to do whatever they want to do as it relates to whatever this hidden agenda is. Here, this is someone being confined or restricted. So that means that someone could either be confined to a space or you could have, she could be inside of something or someone could have something in or be inside of something confined to a space. This represents also someone who is, um, is or has been, um, in prison before. But this is someone who cannot move how they want to move. Okay. All right, so here, this is someone trying to get away from a person or a situation. This is someone, an innocent person being caught up in somebody else's mess. So now this person is trying to get away, okay, from the situation. They're trying to remove themselves from the situation because now they, they didn't got brought into something. And this is a friend. So you have this friend, okay, trying to get away from a situation or a person because somebody, an innocent person, they got caught up in it. So she could be the friend or it could be a friend of hers because this friend here, you got someone in your group of friends or your community that you could trust trying to get away from a person or a situation. This is a friend. This is an innocent person getting caught up in this situation here. Somebody is going along with it because somebody told them about this violence here. And this person is trying to remove themselves from the situation because see, they didn't got caught up in something that somebody else had going on. Over here, like I say, you got someone doing some type of negotiation deals, whatever. Okay. This person is rebellious and they're hard headed. They're going to do whatever it is that they want to do. They're into some illegal activities over here. And you see the drug use or illegal activities here. Someone in her group of friends, someone that she trusted. Okay. This person could have could have been to prison before because they're into some things here. But also this person could be holding her or having her confined somewhere, meaning hidden somewhere or, or locked in some inside of something or whatever the case may be. So like I said, we have someone here in her group of friends that's into some things. Someone else is going along with something, whether that is her or another person is more than likely another person because somebody has been told about something and they're going along with this. Okay. And now somebody has then got caught up in the mix with something that probably this violence here. Okay. So if you want me to go uh, into the regular spread with her, you can just leave a comment in the comment section, but I just wanted to come and see kind of like what was going on with her, but it looks like, there's something else going on, not just somebody following, because I don't know who this man is that's supposed to have been following her, I guess back to her house or whatever. Um, and he claimed he lost track of her. She turned down and he lost track of her. He couldn't find her or whatever the case may be. But um, let me know if you want me to go further into her reading. Thank you.